My name is Maria Myers. I founded U.S. SourceLink. It's a program of the University of Missouri, Kansas City. SourceLink started as an effort to unite the entrepreneurial support organizations in the Kansas City region. Our networks across the country now connect more than 5,000 resource partners who are ready to help entrepreneurs. When we go into a community, we start by identifying who's already there. There are a number of organizations that are national networks, our small business development centers, manufacturing enterprise centers, minority development centers. We also know that city governments, community colleges, universities, all kinds of other resources are available in that community to support entrepreneurship. And we know that resources cluster around the kind of entrepreneur you have, and our resources tend to cluster around four types. We have the innovation-led cluster, your biotechs, your high-tech groups. You often find your serial entrepreneurs there, and there's a whole set of resources that support that kind of environment. Some of our high-tech incubators, our wet lab incubators, our angel groups, our university researchers, you'll find them all hanging around in that cluster. On the opposite end, we have our microenterprise cluster. These are people who are starting businesses to create additional personal income. And there's a whole set of resources available to that group as well. Our micro lending programs, programs throughout the community that support business growth for people who need additional education in starting a business or some additional financing. Then we have our Main Streeters. People that have employees and are along the main streets of our communities all across America. There are doctor's offices, lawyer's offices, independent retailers, restaurants that are making our neighborhoods vibrant. They hire people. They give back to their communities. The owner is investing as much time and energy as they care to, and they're not going to grow too much. Then we have what we call our second stage companies. Second stage companies are established companies who have maybe 10 to 99 employees, and they've got owners who are just raring to take this company to the next level, which is really, how do I find my next market? I think you need to, as a city, decide how are you supporting those four quadrants and what's missing in each of them. I think that our communities do have to go through that conversation. Do we have the basics to start a business? Do we have the basics to fund a business? Do we have the basics to move the business forward? So what's the magic, right? It's really a combination of market, the perseverance of the entrepreneur themselves, and the ability to take advantage of the opportunity in the market. So the best that you can do is provide every resource possible to them to help make them successful. And those that hit the market at the right time with the right opportunity will move forward very rapidly. But those that hit a smaller market can also have a wonderful lifestyle. We need to support that too.